My name is Delpha Le Breton. I'm a senior Goodwill ambassador. I'm 71 years old. I have three children and I live in Rivière du Portage. I took on this role because it's focused on psychological and physical wellness, things that have been part of my whole life. I'm dedicated to community living and promoting intergenerational inclusion by encouraging seniors to adopt a healthy and active lifestyle, and I promote this value through my title. Back in the 80s, I applied for social assistance, which was not easy for me. I took a course, and afterward, they asked me what I wanted to do, and my answer was, I want to be a facilitator. I wanted to do the same job that person was doing. Afterwards, I took some more classes. I worked on my self-esteem, and at some point, somebody believed in me and gave me a job as a facilitator. And that's what I've been doing ever since. I host Kizen sessions, which are initiation to meditation, yoga, and free tai chi. And I was invited to host a meditation session at an event called Wow, Some Fait Du Bien. It was focused on mental health for people of all ages. I also did one for kids at the La Ruche School. It was about Mandela's. It was fun to see people of all ages drawing and coloring, putting on paper what they had felt after the meditation. Now I want to talk about physical activity, about winter. I'm an active member of the Administration Council of Les Guilurans for cross-country skiing. To me, it's important not to stay indoors and that we encourage folks to stay active during winter, to cross-country ski, and that we protect the environment for future generations. As for my own family, I'm pretty sure I had lots of influence on their lifestyle. When they were young, because we didn't have a car, we would go into town on bikes or by foot, and I would sometimes say, keep moving. We'll take our time, there's no rush. We can stop and take a break. And now the tables are turning because when I myself am challenged, my children will now say, come on, mom, we'll take our time and take little breaks too. You're almost there. They encourage me to go the extra mile. In my community, a couple of years back, investments were made to pave a pedestrian walkway. And it's really great because now I can go there with my bike. I can rollerblade, and lots of lots of people use this new walkway. Folks who didn't walk before because it was inconvenient, it's such a beautiful sight. People are really participating on this walkway. So life is full of surprises, and we have to focus on what is yet to come. Since I've passed the 65 milestone, there have been so many new things in my life that I had to get an appointment book. <laughs>